Hey everyone, this is DHTV, and today we're taking a look at the Fitbit Flex. Now, for those of you that aren't familiar with the Fitbit Flex, it's basically like the Jawbone Up or the Nike Fuel Band, except it's got its own take on a fitness bracelet. What this one in particular is going to do is allow you to track your steps, your sleeping pattern, and help you achieve your fitness goals. Now this particular bracelet was pretty hard for me to come by in my area so I went ahead and placed the link in the description down below so you can check it out, get full specifications and reviews and even pick one up for yourself. So let's go ahead and open up the box here. As you can see it's on like a pedestal so it's a pretty interesting unboxing and the first thing that you're going to see is the paperwork when you open the box and it's just telling you to go to a certain website to set it up and we'll get into that a little bit later. Now the first thing you're going to take a look at here is actually a second band and it actually comes with two of them. One of them is a larger size and this one right here is the smaller size band. So if you have a child or if you just have small wrists, you have two sizes here you can go by and each one of them has notches in them. So it's a pretty much uh, one size fits all when you combine the two bands together. Also included is the wireless dongle which will allow you to sync and set up through your computer. Now you can sync via your smartphone by using the free Fitbit application. Finally we have the USB charger and the Fitbit Flex can last up to 5 days on a single charge. Now let's take a look at the Fitbit Flex itself and as you can see I went for the black version but they do have a slate as well as other colored bands you can choose from and it's made out of a rubbery material which is really comfortable to wear. It is a little bit difficult to put on with the clasp but what's really good about this material is that it's fully waterproof so you can actually take a shower without ruining the device. Now when it does come time to charge it you do need to pull out the actual heart of the device and it's quite small but you just simply insert it into the USB charger and you're good to go. Now in terms of what this device can actually do for you, you can track your steps, your distance, your calories burned, your active minutes, the hours you've slept, the quality of your sleep, the times you woke up, and it actually can wake you up in the morning with a silent vibrating alarm. Now the Fitbit Flex Band itself also can show you what you've done through the day with a series of LED lights. Now the more LED lights you see, the more you have done for the day and the closer you are to your goal. So if your goal is a thousand steps and you've only done a hundred, you're you're probably only going to see one LED light, which is a good reminder you need to get off the couch and get active. Now setting up your Fitbit Flex is really easy. All you need to do is plug in the USB dongle which will allow you to sync and set up the Fitbit Flex. You want to then click new to Fitbit and either create your account with your Facebook, your Google account or you can use your email. Once you've inserted your personal information and created your account you can click on the Flex version of the devices and it's going to go through somewhat of a tour here. You can read through it and learn how to remove the device for charging, how to put it on and different things like that. Just go ahead and click next and the part we're most focusing on is this one right here where the dongle has to be close enough to the device so that it can sync and you want to see this page right here and if everything is done correctly it should move you over to this one right here where it says flex found. Now it wants you to lightly tap the display on the device twice and when you feel the little buzz on your wrist then you can go ahead and click I feel the buzz also it won't turn to the pink color until you've done that. Now you're going to see some information on the device itself it's going to say how the goals work various things like that and it's going to go through the website and this is basically where you're going to track everything unless you have a smartphone in which case you can use the free Fitbit application. Anyway guys I hope you enjoyed the video if you want to pick up the Fitbit Flex I'm going to put the link in the description down below with some reviews and the specifications as well as I said at the beginning. I hope you enjoyed this video I know I did and I know I'm going to enjoy using this device and let's see how this helps me achieve some of my fitness goals. Anyway let me know also if you've ever used a fitness band in the past like the Nike Fuel Band or Jawbone Up. Don't forget, hit that like button, subscribe for more videos. I post Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. And as always, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.